Today, we read about the birth of John the Baptist. Everyone present knew the extraordinary circumstances surrounding his birth. Zechariah was already too old. Elizabeth was not only old as well, but was barren at that. Everyone felt something special was happening right before their eyes. Luke narrates that fear descended on all the neighborhood. They treasured the events in their hearts. They wondered what would become of the child they felt underdressed before the mystery that unfolded before their very eyes. The late Bishop Fulton Sheen once said that the water at Cana turned into wine because the water blushed when it saw the face of Jesus. He is right. Blushing in awe and worship is the only appropriate stance before God. Why don't we blush anymore today? How come we take communion like we're just receiving a wafer? How come we approach Christmas, the awesome mystery of the God who became man, as just one among the many holidays in the calendar? Admit it, we have become so cavalier before God in His mysteries. It's not that God needs our attention, He does not. We are the ones who benefit from every encounter with God. It makes us grow in grace, and genuine worship. The next time you go to Mass or the Adoration Chapel, remind your heart who you are facing. You will surely blush in awe. Reflection Question Do you prepare for Christmas as an encounter with God?